So this is something that helps with that. I went from doing that every garbage day to hardly ever throwing away any fruits and vegetables. And I tell you what, when I do end up throwing away my fruits and vegetables, oh, I get so mad at myself. I'm like, shame on me. I had three weeks to eat that and I didn't eat it. Oh, you know? All right. So our Fridge Smart line, it, um, like I said, it's designed to make your fruits and vegetables last three to four times longer. And it does it in a couple different ways. One way, it vents. How many of you are familiar with those Debbie Meyer green bags? Yes? The infomercials? Yes. yes. Yeah. They vent. And so that's something that we do. Um, and we got together with the University of Florida and we teamed together with them. And, you know, we came up with this process and we, we came up with this product for you to enjoy in your home. And so we have the venting. And so, like, um, let's see here. They're medium heavy and, and light gassers is what the different vegetables are. And carrots are a light, so you want both of these. These are the vents. You want both of these closed because it doesn't emit, it doesn't um, put a lot of gases out there. So um, the leafy green lettuces, those are medium. So you want one open, you push on the bottom, one open, one closed. Now, if you push this and it pops off, it's okay. It's meant to pop off so in case you want to clean it, okay? So don't worry about it. Every time I do party, somebody's like, I broke this. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, you got to buy the whole set. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I won't make you do that. But, <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so, so okay, the medium, you want one open, one closed. And then the, let's see here, broccoli. Broccoli is heavy gas. I don't think you need me to tell you that, right? We all know broccoli is heavy gas. Or you want to air that out, okay? So you want both of these open. Now, broccoli is a prime example because... If your broccoli is closed up in an airtight container, the gases actually start to rot the skin. That's one of the things that makes it makes it go bad so quickly, is those gases are rotting the skin. Now, if you properly vent it, it lets those gases out and it gives it a chance to breathe. All right, so the other thing that is remarkable about this product is one, it's a green product. It's something that you're gonna be able to use now, 10 years from now, 20 years from now, 30 years from now. You're, it's something that you're gonna be able to use. It's a reusable product. And um, it also, uh, it's nice and hard. I was kind of tapping on earlier. It's nice and hard. And the good thing about that, this nice hard shell, is it protects your fruits and vegetables. All right, now you can admit it because we're among friends, but how many of you go to the Christopher Drain got one more cucumber to squeeze in there and you do one of these? Oh, I know I can fit it in there if I could just, and you push all your lettuce and all this stuff down to the bottom. Well, that is actually kind of helping the aging process because it, all of your fruits and vegetables bruise just like an apple does, but you don't see it, but that's where it starts to age quicker. So by doing one of these, <laughs> that's going to help it age a little bit faster. So that's something to kind of think about. Now this keeps it nice and safe in here, so you can stack these in your refrigerator. And a lot of times what I do is I take that crisper drawer and I put my sodas in there. I put things like that. I put cream cheese, you know, anything that's kind of in a container, I just kind of throw down in there. So there is something that you can use those for. Some refrigerators, the newer ones, these will actually fit right down in there. I just have an older refrigerator, so it doesn't fit in mine. I have the triangular shaped drawers. So, um, so I just kind of use it for other things, condiments, things like that. So it's something to kind of consider. Now, I don't, you don't have to remember the venting process because it's all right here and it's lasered in. It's never going anywhere. So that's something really important to remember. Now, this down here, this is a drainage system. And the drainage system allows the water to drain down into the bottom. It goes back up into the air and it and forms condensation. It just rains down your fruits and vegetables, keeping them nice and clean and nice and, and um, nice and fresh and all that kind of fun stuff. It's a perfect environment for them. But broccoli, last over 22 days in here, we call it the broccoli challenge. We challenge you to, to keep your broccoli for 22 days. Also strawberries, I've had strawberries last two weeks. When they're in season, they're buy one, get one. It's like buy one, get one, throw away. Two weeks in here, I got to the end of them. It was remarkable. Now, as we're closing, I wanna tell you a little bit about a couple of friends of mine. And these are friends that I have in Tupperware. And um, the first person I wanna tell you about is um, Sherry. <laughs> Sherry has eight kids. She's a very hectic schedule. They're all almost teenagers and then she has a toddler kind of running around. Very hectic schedule, but she likes to squeeze in her Tupperware business because she works three jobs and she's missing out on a lot of their life. So that's something that she does. Now I also have a friend, her name is Jeannie. And Jeannie has MS and she is a school teacher. And at the end of the day, she is tired. She doesn't want to go out and do a party. But in Tupperware's program, it allows her to do fundraising. So she offers fundraisers to churches, daycare, schools, and we give 40% back to the organization. That's huge. That is very competitive in the fundraising market. So she does that a little bit on the side for the extras, camps, all these things the kids want to do. 
Um, now I also have a gal on my team, her name is Sam. My mother, she had three jobs and went to school full time. Whoa. <laughs> I told her she could make more money selling Tupperware and she laughed at me. I think she only started because she wanted to prove me wrong. <laughs> well, now she's a director with Tupperware. During her first year, she started picking off those jobs one at a time. And now all she does is Tupperware and go to school full time. She's doing fantastic. And last but certainly not least is my good friend, Melinda. And Melinda came to Tupperware about nine months ago or so. And just recently, her son has been uh, diagnosed with bipolar disorder. And she has, um, and, and she's got a lot of doctor's appointments in her future, and she knows this. And she wants to make sure she can be there for each and every one of them. And she wants to make sure she doesn't have a boss breathing down her neck saying, listen, you can't take off another day. You can't go and do this now. And so that's why she's building her Tupperware business. Now, the reason why I tell you about these ladies is because I want you to know that they're just like you. They're just like me. They do, everybody has their problems. Everybody has ups and downs in their lives and different needs in their lives. And some people just want to get out and talk to people above three feet tall. And that's kind of why I started direct sales years ago. Um, but, uh, you know, they did. They took a chance. They pictured themselves in my shoes. And they decided to give Tupperware a try for 30 days. And that's all I'm encouraging you to do. Give it a try for 30 days. I did. And it changed my family. It changed my life. It changed me. Made me more confident in me. And that's something that it can do for you as well. So thank you all so much for coming tonight. And Linda, thank you so much for having me into your home. Thank you. Oh, absolutely. And your friends and family are just as nice as you said they'd be. Thank you.